She worked in this little bar in the Philippines. Oh, man. She had a smile that'd melt your heart. Bro, I swear to God, she just as soon kill you as kiss you if she caught you stepping out. Just a wee bit of a thing. She couldn't have been much more than 4'11". They called her the spinner because she... Will you shut up, old man? You told us that one a dozen times already. Oh, yeah, right. <laughs> of course I did. Memory is not what it used to be. What the hell's taking you so long anyway? Well, maybe you hadn't noticed, but most of these books are half rotten. And written in Spanish. Yeah, we'll hurry it up. The boss is waiting on you. Hey! Up there! Ah, oh, crap. Oh, my God! time you showed up. <sighs> well, you're looking awfully good for a corpse. So you brought the girl after all, huh? The girl? Hey, if it wasn't for her, you wouldn't be getting rescued right now. If this is a rescue... What the hell does that mean? You gotta admit, Sully, this all looks a little shady. Yeah. I mean, you tipping those guys off... And miraculously showing up alive? Now wait a goddamn minute. Roman had a contract out on me. I needed to buy some time. All right, stupid mistake. I didn't realize they'd try and track us. Sully, we would have been headed home with the treasure by now if you had just for once kept your mouth shut. And you might have thought of checking for a pulse before running off and leaving me for dead. Look, none of that matters now. All right, so how is it you're standing here breathing and all, huh? <laughs> you are not going to believe this. Huh? huh? No way! <laughs> Old Francis took a bullet for you. Yeah. I thought this kind of thing only happened in the movies. Yeah, well, it still hurt like a son of a bitch, I'll tell you that. <laughs> I bet. Anyway, once they realized I wasn't dead, I convinced Roman that they would never find the treasure without me. So I've been trying to mislead him ever since, waiting for you to show up. Well, where are they now? Well, they're chasing a little red herring I sent him on on the other side of the monastery to get rid of him. <laughs> Look. Drake had it all figured out. See, that's the symbol the Spanish used to mark their secret vaults. The treasure is hidden right here in this monastery. Find the symbol, and we, we find, find the, the vault. vault. We have everything we need right here. All the clues to take us right to the treasure. We can do this, kid. <laughs> all right, you boys aren't gonna get all chummy and leave the girl behind again, are you? <laughs> Don't even think about it, Sully. She's got a mean right hook. I'll keep that in mind. There's more to this room than meets the eye. I'm sure of it. Hmm. Something about these statues.
No, that's not right. Okay. You know, this looks familiar. The inverted torch leads to the land of the dead. <sighs> wow, this looks promising. Here, let me see that? Yeah. Okay. You two sit tight. I'm gonna check things out. Whoa, wait, no. You're not going out there alone. Yeah, Roman's men are swarming all over this place. Yeah, and one person will make a lot less noise than three. Come on, I'll be fine. And you guys will be safe here. They don't even know about this room. Okay, take this with you. Leave it on channel 13. They don't use that one. And keep us posted. All right, you got it. Close this thing back up. Yeah. Nate? Be careful. <laughs> Come on. I always am. Ah! I did not see that! Ah! <sighs> 